A new computer game puts players in the shoes of migrants desperate to reach Europe. As CBS News correspondent Gwen Baumgartner explains, the game's creators are hoping to highlight the struggles of refugees around the world. A human rights group is using this virtual game to change reality for migrants. Campaigners are urging players and government leaders to empathize with families attempting to cross borders into Europe. It seems like we stopped caring. It seems like uh, we have accepted it as a given reality. The game is called Razor Wire, and each move puts players in the footsteps of European refugees on their journey to find a new life. They have to travel at night. They have to avoid the police. They are often uh, robbed or their documents are taken away by the police. The game has three levels, including escaping a war-torn country, dodging a police raid at a migrant camp, and crossing a river while avoiding bodies of others who have died during the trip. Creators say real-life refugees refer to the journey as a game of survival. Many of them have tried the game uh, 10 times or more, um, and they continue trying until they uh, enter uh, Europe. But winning the game is nearly impossible since players, just like refugees, only have one life. Gwen Baumgartner, CBS News, London.